You just meet good people. And I'm so excited to have her here. I met her actually on, well, I've been a fan, but then I met her in person um, in uh, a rooftop in Brooklyn. Like I tell everybody, Brooklyn is the new Manhattan in Williamsburg. Uh, It was super dope. It was a mamante. We have Brittany Benson in the building, ladies and gentlemen. Anyone who knows... Miss Brittany, no, she is a whole vibe, a, a, a whole momente. Welcome to the Who's Styling Who Show. Thank you. I know you're super busy. You do radio yourself. So thank you for finding time out your busy schedule to come and rock out Yo, with, 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 with me. I know that shit sounds like so cliche, but I'm serious. Thank no, you. actually, you know, we're a mafia. I'm sorry. This is the PSA. Light skin mafia, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I, I'm sorry. You know, I love all races, but we are yeah. one. You know, the world is beige now. I'm sorry. <laughs> Guys wanted to mix it, so I'm just I'm telling you facts. Shout out to my mom. She worked for the census. Anything I say is always factual. I try to do it so I can have a source to go by. So, yeah. Hi. What up? What up? Welcome. I see you bought another light skin. I'm see this. It was going to <laughs> yeah. what I was saying. You see? It's light skin. It's yeah. It's no, it has nothing to do with that. Cut it out. No, I'm just That's joking. You know, I love my chocolate. Yeah. My mama's no, chocolate. I know, I know, I know. But I love you guys. All the chocolate, but shout out to all the fucking caramel chocolate too. Chocolate. Shout out to all the skins, I'm ladies skin. and gentlemen. Oh. <laughs> I just love, I just love all races. I only say that. Shout out to my girl, to Tracy Escobar. That's her thing, light skin mafia. So whenever, anytime I say it, I always just reference her. Yeah. Mondays, 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 Mondays. Yes. Yeah. So I'm super excited, Brittany. Where do you hail from? I don't know. You're over uh, a little bit <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> yeah, because I don't really see what you claim. I never. I don't know. Like this is. Nah. This is why I'm happy to be like. Well, I'm black. I'm black. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So <laughs> what? Um, <laughs> she said, I don't know. <laughs> what? No, no. You know, I always did that. Everybody wants me to be everything but black. But Where? I'm African American. Nah, you gotta represent. Are nah. you mixed though with anything? Nah. Not really. Okay. Cool. You know. They probably raped some of my. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's historical <laughs> shit, but we straight black out here. Yeah, well, that's crazy. Really know what's up. Well, let's get into the music and just a little bit about you. Where are you from, as far as like what borough? What are you claiming? Any particular? Well, um, I was born in the Bronx. Yay, BX, yes. you're up. Yeah, yeah. But I was raised in Virginia. Oh wow, Norfolk yeah. is Suffolk. Oh okay. <laughs> <laughs> Suffolk, Virginia. Yeah, How's yeah. that? That's like forty minutes from me. Uh, Norfolk. Oh, okay. It's Yo, very... Norfolk, How far is Newport yeah. News? Because that's where my family is. Like Yo, Newport News is the shit. I okay. don't know where it's at, but it's fine. Shout out to everybody in Newport News. I'm glad you think so. But uh, that shit's boring as fuck. But it has a lot of creative people out there. Like, it's so boring. Like, we can't do anything but create. <laughs> so, you do a radio show, right? Actually, I'm not doing a radio show oh, right now. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, okay. the partner split up, but. It happens. You know. You're a whole vibe, so I think you should be doing podcasts. You two just listening Bro. to everything that was going on outside. Remember. I love doing podcasts. You, you got to do it. You got to do it. I'm going to get back on it. I'm going to get back on it. Um, the partner split up. I was like, yo, I was upset. You know, but it's cool. Shit happens. We move forward. We out here. I'm still here. Like, now I'm on your show. What's up? So I'm so excited. Yeah. Feel free whenever you get the buzz. Monday, you know, the, the, ooh, the little itch. Come. Co- I have no co-host, so always come. Anytime you want oh, to pass yeah. through, come through. Let's vibe. Bring you new artists. Know. You know you have you have all with tons of artists that I know will slide through. So please feel free. Let Monday be your new spot to uh, invite artists. Even if you don't touch the mic, if you want them to get a radio shine, please uh, let them know you have a spot for them. Do. So you have some new music. Yeah. I just want the whole entire world to vibe out and understand what she's about. If you could really work with anybody in the industry, who would it be? Because you just are so eclectic with music. Is there anybody that you are vibing to really want to work with? Anybody that's not afraid to step outside the box. Okay. Mm, that's that's not... a million dollar answer right there. <laughs> no, because I'll be doing answer. like, you know, I'm, I'm on my own shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm not trying to fit into like nobody box. I'm not trying to like blend in with the crowd or, you know, fit in with the crowd. So anybody that's not afraid to like take a chance, that's okay. what I want to work with. 
What's the first record you bought for us? Uh, Visionary. I have that right, out right now. It's on all digital platforms. Make sure it's you go Vision. watch that video. Yeah. Who produced the record? I did. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> so not only... Oh, well, we'll get back into oh, that, but let, I just want everybody to understand. Only. Get a vibe. I get it's a vibe. It's a vibe. World premiere in the Who's Style and Who shows. The first time I'm playing the record. Let's it. go! You can stand up. You can do whatever you want. Give us a live performance. A vibe. I can't afford you right now, but... What up, S. Anthony? S. Anthony. What up, Whitney? What up, MM Boutique? What up, Real Make Swag? I'm not even going to tell you what I want to say right after. Yeah. Mm. Ooh, yeah. I told you she was a babate bigger than a bobe. No one listens to me. Naked. I'm supposed to be sitting like in a bra and panty. <laughs> I'm like, Jesus! This is, that's that. Whew. Well, musically, you're very inclined. What would you, huh? You don't think so? You can't, oh, I'm sorry. Oops, 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 oops. I'm sorry, 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 sorry. My mic sounds nice. Check one. Hey, shout out to ASAP Rocky, though. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, wait. Did he say that? But then I'm. Yeah, no, you, I yeah that you millenniums, you millenniums. Listen, we're beautiful. You guys are very disrespectful, but I, <laughs> I kind of under. Shit, you do, and I don't understand now that I have a millennium here. Like, <laughs> why do you guys just don't like? You're such dope creators, but you guys don't think. Like you see how you just said ASAP Rocky when I that was not from ASAP Rocky. So where did that come from? I'm gonna tell you, but 
Yeah, I'm, I'm serious. That's the first time I've ever heard that phrase from ASAP Rocky. Nice, nice, nice. Right, nice. Okay, she bought him here, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, this is Everything is the manifestation of past stuff, anyway. Uh, then you want to go philosophical, <laughs> lot of just see you, millennials. <laughs> I tell you guys, I can't. Yeah, our mind frame is on millennial time. That's the reason why. Okay. You know what? That's the caller of the day. Three four seven seven two one three one six one. Who said my mic sounds nice? Check one. Whoever calls okay. it is calling. Bring me on to the knowledge. Bring me on to the knowledge. Joey, sick. Can you answer the question? I do not have the answer. Oh my oh, god! Oh, oh my you know god! What? Oh my god. Thank you very much. Pa- the real Thank Papa you. Pretty. Who said my mic sells nice? Check one. Thank you for being um, honest. Who? Give me a second. Oh, Give me a second. So I'm Pepper. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, Pepper. Jesus. I am so hurt. I'm so hurt right now. And I'm sure somebody else is going to DM me, DM me and say it wasn't salt and pepper. We, we going to say salt and pepper we right back. <laughs> Brittany, oh man. So what's a studio session like with you? Because you you play live mm-hmm. music. You, I saw you perform live. Yeah. Wow. Like, take us through that. Honestly, Can you just... Cause... Honestly, a studio session is just me. I know. My own world. I have my own little studio in my house. Okay. Um, so it's just me and my own world. Figuring shit out. Putting sounds together, taking sounds away, just getting a whole vibe, and you know, honestly, it's not that deep. I just like to experiment, you know. Experiment how? In what way? Experiment with who? Nah, I'm joking. I'm just joking. That's not this show, you know. We, I get in people's business, but we ain't gonna talk about all of that. Did you, did you bring another record with you, or just the yeah, one record? Yeah, nah, nah, I got another record. It's called "It Ain't the Alcohol Talking." This is the shit that gets the crowd. I need jumping. to hear that. Let's go into that record. Who produced that record? Whoa, 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 whoa. Um, Who produced that record? I just want to hear you say it. Yeah. Go ahead. I produced it. Yeah. Woo! I okay. all my shit, I record my own shit, I arrange my own shit, I write my own shit. Go. Ready, Vincent, let's go. I just wanted to see, I was waiting go. for her to do that. Sometimes you gotta push the people and to get into the mountain. That's that shit right here.
this. Yes, right. I got my little dress on. See, I followed the dress code. Hi, ass queen, Deve. Mr. B got skills. What up, Whitney? Y'all always think I'm on drugs anyway. really want to know the way I feel about half of you Americans, but since we're going to segue it, please stop doing that 10 year challenge. I'm over it. How many more days am I going to have to see this shit? Half of you guys are not even putting up the real 10 year pictures. This is Instagram. Do you really think that I believe that that picture is from 10 years ago? Stop it! And this is the problem with Social media, y'all come up with these challenges. Why don't we do the let's see the amount of money you have in your bank account challenge? I bet you nobody is gonna do that. I bet you no one's gonna post a thousand dollars that they don't have in their bank account. All your favorite celebrities that you know mm -hmm, get free stuff, product placement. But I'm just saying, let's do a new challenge. Support everybody that you follow challenge. How about that? Let's do that. So let's make New York City. That's a serious challenge. Support. Yeah, I just made up my own challenge and shit. Yeah, let's see. Let's make it go viral. Hold up. Let's see. I'm going to put it on social media. Let's try this again, ladies and gentlemen. I came up with my own challenge. It's called Support Everyone You Follow Challenge. If you know that they have... Oh, my mic was up. No wonder. You see, the devil is... A, the, the devil is a liar. You see? The devil is a liar. If you support people, we're going to do the support trip, support the people you follow challenge, right? You support celebrities, well, support the people you follow. How about that? So, you, so we know you support celebrities. They don't even like it. They don't even like your pictures on Instagram. But imagine if you support the people that really support you. Ooh, I'll wait. Okay, hallelujah. We're gonna talk. We're gonna talk about this every Monday. And to do that challenge, I'm no longer posting on Instagram unless it's supporting somebody else. Oh, wait a minute. I've been doing that my whole career. That's the whole styling who show. Every Monday, 8 to 10. Ooh, my crown fell off. Let me tell you why. Because I'm prophesizing. We're about to get... Okay, hold on. I feel the church coming. <laughs> Let me tell you why. Okay, 2019 is still the first month, so everybody's still in that spirit. Like, yes, we support one another. I promise. Ca carry that on to February. March, April, May. Let's go. Like, for real. So, if you check my Instagram, who's styling who, but Kalia Clark, that's what I do. I am the product placement queen. I support everybody. You see this dress? Yep. Artistic fashion. Brittany Benson. The real proper pretty. Reese is in the building. I have to call you Millennium because you did not. You said ASAP Rocky. But somebody did a whole nother thing. What's your name again? I love you. What's your name again? I love you. Contrast. Con right. Contrast. Ladies and gentlemen, look at his wardrobe. Listen. It goes, it goes. His whole style is eclectic. I love him. Yo, ASAP Rocky. So if you see me, you already know I'm hot. You it's are. <laughs> Can we talk about the mood ring you have on? That is what listen, kind of stone is that? Listen. You are I, lit. I got fucking lapis lazuli on the neck. Oh, spell that. Clear oh. There you go. There you go. I don't want to talk too much about that, but you already know. Don't only give him away because you know <laughs> niggas is wearing Nassau right now, so they'll be right behind you listen. saying whatever. So who's your fashion inspiration? Yeah. My fashion inspiration, honestly, I love just the art of being able to express yourself through fashion. That's the thing. I don't have anybody who's like, oh, I look to them for style tips and et cetera, et cetera. It's yeah. just like the art of fashion. Like, it's free. You know? I believe There's you. no rules. I love your hat. What does it say? Thank you. It says Cherry Bomb. That's an album by Tyler Creator. That's one of my favorite artists. Yeah, he's good. Yeah. yeah. 
I on like you. I might bring you back for a whole segment. On the scene. I would yep. love to be here. I love it. So do we want to say anything about him? Is he an artist you're working with? Because what, what does he do besides be fabulous and great? <laughs> and, and, and we're going to start working together. We are? Yeah. She brought you on radio and put exactly. you on the side and let you sit on the exactly. side. You yeah. don't find, like, stay under this her. Is like, don't mean this that is a position bad, that's just, this is rare standing. shit. That's huh? what it boils down to. This is just rare. Oh, you are rare. Shout out yeah. to um, Rare. <laughs> Shout out to Rare. No, that's a clothing <laughs> brand. That's what I'm saying. There. Shout out to them. F1. They're called, um, yeah. Shout out to Rare Shout clothing. Out to rare. He's a dope ass kid. Like, you are. If you were a producer too, he's a dope ass kid. You know, I <laughs> produce my shit. You know, shit. I have a studio in my house too. Uh-huh. I like mix and master things. I like. What's your um, social media so people can. Uh, you uh, can find me on a calm Instagram page by the name of anti dot contrast anti dot contrast. Shouts out to contrast. That's me. <laughs> nice, um, Britton. Is there anything I didn't talk about? Cause you've been in the game for a very long time. How long? Too long. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Not long. You have a lot of dope friends. You're very known on yeah. the music scene. Um, is like, what advice do would you want to give an uh, artist? That's in the business because you have a lot of celebrity friends that you know you don't even really talk about, and that's what I love. Like you're just your own person. They yeah. talk a lot about you, yeah. so that's cool. Like, how do you maintain that and just stay yourself without getting lost in your celebrity friends? Because you have a lot of celebrity friends. I maintain it by being myself. Cool. You know what I mean? So that's the best advice I can give: be yourself. You know, live by your own rules. Do what you want to do. You know, and don't follow the trends. Set the trends. What trends are you think you're studying? Because you're into fashion, everything. Just fucking being an individual. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, just doing what you believe in. If you could say one thing that you would want to get rid of in the culture, what would it be? Mm. Let's get rid of all the followers. Okay. You know what I'm saying? I mean, when where I say followers, is like, <laughs> yeah, where my leaders where are. Where my leaders are. But it's like, it's cool because we want our followers because shit, that's that's the reason we have fans and shit but like artists is just like bro everybody riding the same wave you're gonna drown by the same wave you know what I mean yeah. like at the same damn time cause as soon as that shit is over everybody's done gone besides listening to yourself who is in your um playlist uh Prince he's always in my playlist mm. that's like my number one if you could've worked with him you would've loved to right Absolutely. that was your if could so we know I met Prince. him though oh Tell us that story. Wow. Did he give you a kiss on the hand? No, he gave me this look like you are dumb. You looking at? Why are you staring at me? I'm like, cause you're fucking prince. And <laughs> but it's like Electric Lady Studios, and um, oh, he came awesome. walking down the stairs, and everybody's like, "Don't stare at prince." I'm like, "Fuck that!" I'm staring at prince. Yeah, like, what? So I'm like, he came down like with a purple outfit, like some real prince shit, like perm hair, like looking, giving the eyes and shit, and I'm just like, a little thugged out and shit, like. And he just came down and he just like caught eye contact. And he walked down the hall and I'm just like staring at him. And he did this little smirk at me and I was just like, ha ah. <laughs> Was this before social media? You know, yeah, pictures, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah? Yeah, Nah. Anybody else if you could work with them besides Prince? Uh, no, that's awesome. You don't have to answer the question. <laughs> no, it's not even that I want to answer, don't, but I can't don't. think of anybody right now. I'm like, really want to work with. Uh, I mean, I, I like a lot of different artists. I'm, I'm into like, um, I fucks with Travis Scott. I fuck with oh, hey, my boy Mark Andre. I fucks with um, mm, Ro James. I want to work with him. I think he's a dope artist. Uh, yeah. Any fashion? Yeah. I see you doing a fashion <laughs> brand. Do you have <laughs> Brianna? I mean, like, do you think you see yourself doing a fashion brand? Because I know a lot of your friends are, are designers and different things. Are you gonna? You, you have any what? collabs coming out? I love men's fashion. My my brother, you know, I work on him. Shout out to Leah Vision. So sad. That shit's been doing really well. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? So that's what I'm working with right now. You know, I'm a little tipsy, so. Yes, well, those that have bought tea, I'm telling you, Mondays are the new Friday. The reason why we had this in the DM, I told you. My homegirl right here, Enzel Box. Enzel Box, step up to the mic. There's three chairs if you want to. Are you coming in? Come in, come in, come in, come in. I I like to bring people in. Hey, you know what I'm saying? Like, connect 
Welcome. Unlike other people, so, you know. <laughs> After Britney oh. Pence, we have Reese in the building, and he's in the yeah, back. He's super dumb. And the reason everybody. why everyone is stuttering is Yo, shout out to you. I Thank you. Shout no, out to you. No, shout out to That's you. That's why everyone stuttered. I love it. I just tried to create it. Oh, he fell. I had to say it because they saw you <laughs> on the live. I took my headphones um, yeah. yeah. Mark, I'm not held liable. Okay. I'm not held liable for that. I just started walking right away. <laughs> Hi, Mama. What's up? Oh, throw that. There's a, there's a mic right there. Hold on. Yo, pass the mic. What's up? What's up? No, hold on. Oh, okay. Jen is carrying. We you can't take that mic and you take that third wait, mic. Wait, I there you go. Take that mic. Yeah, Everybody has a mic. Mic, pull it up. Yep. Oh. Yep, there you go. Three mics, one leg. This is interesting. I just made that up. <laughs> <laughs> All together, I was over there. I don't know where you did that from. Hold on. But this is my own. You're what? Homie. You're homie? homie? Okay, you're lucky I'm not one of those nah, type of nah. interviews. I mean, hey, you can go in, but I got like, it. Man, it's so. Hi, hi. Hi, hi. Anything. What's up? You know well, you know, we know, I know what you like. And those, I don't know if, look, the camera fell. That's out of the closet, so. That's awesome. <laughs> Well, now that you brought it up, <laughs> you know, I try to be, res- I try to be, res- no, I try to, like, I get it. I try to be respectful of everyone. You know, sometimes the things she love, but I'll answer the question for her. All right, cool. So, this is where this, this is where it gets very eclectic. So, um, right in the first song. When you say, you know what I like, you know, I like to keep my lady. So how does a lady last with you? Because you must really be like the, yeah, like what do you like in a lady? Who? I like very, if you well, I have a I love Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Nice feminine women. Are, are you are you single? Yeah, I'm single. Oh yeah, so we're gonna do live here. Call me up the next Monday. She comes to co-host. It'll be the Britney Benson dating oh, show. So we're gonna find her a lucky lover in February. Not crazy. So are you the best friends that you know for high school? You're gonna be the co-host, and we're gonna find the perfect love for Britney Benson. <laughs> Give them, your, give them your social media and where they can find. <laughs> so what do you do? You sing, write, produce too? Um, yeah, I sing, write, produce, but I also design. Beautiful. And Bach, that's my line. Nice, bring it back. Any Monday, I'm a celebrity fashion stylist. I love it. Um, bring some models. We do a little walkthrough here. Keep a whole little, it's like, yeah, but it's like a pop-up thing. Mondays are the new Fridays. I don't see a drink in your hand, so we won't judge you for that. <laughs> The whole, you got to go say it's an outside thing, and then you come in, and then you be all bubbly, but in between breaks. So, um, give them your social media where they can find you. Um, Instagram, Amzobot. Can we spell that? Yeah, Yeah, because, you know, I... A-M-Z-E-L-B-B-O-C. Okay, that's perfect. Um, Once you started spelling, I had a brain (laughs) fart. I'm not going to lie to you. But uh, if you could work with anybody or have anybody in your designs, who would it be? Designer wise? Yeah, like, or any artist, anybody you want to work with. This is the whole style of who we manifested here. Whatever goes out into the world, it happens. Mm-hmm. Listen, Trust me. Yeah, yeah, I did it because I knew he was going to say something. Yeah. <laughs> that's, why, that's why I set it up and threw the ball. <laughs> he caught it, right? <laughs> Thank you. Um, well, I feel like my brand is for anybody. I pretty much work with. A lot of people. Um, is it custom? Do you do a lot yeah, of it? Is a lot custom. Of custom. Is it yeah, custom? Yeah. yeah. Is it Most glasses? What is the glasses? It's the neck piece. It's outerwear. It's clothing. Yeah. Um, accessories. Jewelry. It's dope. Um, are you have? Does anybody have any pieces of hers on? Nothing. One piece. Just me. Let me see. Ah, I got my shit on. Nah, uh, <laughs> let me see. Is that the neck thing you're yeah, wearing? That's the neck. I love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. And love she's it. sitting behind the fucking sewing machine and she sews that shit. Uh, what are the price points on that? Uh, it depends on you. 
<laughs> Just for, you know, the millennium kids, that's when they buy it. If they two twenty five or more, they don't want it, honey. Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Or is it quality shit? It depends. I can hit your price point. Just don't expect the same quality. Nice. <laughs> um, but it's still good quality. What's the website so they can go up on it? Or do you want them to DM you? How do you work? They can DM you. DM them? DM Ladies and gentlemen, who styling who? Brittany, you bought your whole crew. Is there anything else I didn't talk about? You're coming back up. I need to see this full. I need stuff on the table. I need to to survive. I love you. I love you. Thank you for having me. No, you're not. This is not the this last. Is not the last. First of all, I need to come up and co-host with you. I, I told, I told you. But like, I miss this. You know, not being. I don't know. And just do yeah. My own thing so and Monday, let me tell you. Whenever you get that itch, which you're not. Whenever you feel that <laughs> spirit that comes and just want to open up, let me be the vessel. Here you go. Thank uh, you. Not that you're not ever welcome back. <laughs> I'm just saying that when, let me just say, whenever, you know, the seat's always open, so feel free. Because I know you got some dope people that I've never met. I'm telling you, your contact list is a mamante. So feel free. Pull it up. Like, ah, you know what? I feel like doing radio Monday. Call me. Trust me. I have no call. Home, so. So let's keep that a connection. Thank you for Brittany. the opportunity. Did you bring three songs or one? Do you want me to close back out with anything nah, else? Nah, that's it. Um, which one did we close out with? So he could just play it as the closing. Yeah, Visionary, that's what's out now. Visionary's out on our social you know media. Visionary. Brittany Benton. B-R-I-T-N-E-Y. Thank you for stopping by, baby. Thank you. Let's go take some pictures. Wait, 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 wait,